Hello everybody, it is Psychotank here for the SFN Bomber channel. I'm going to be doing a video on uh, Netherwing Egg spawn locations and how to get Netherwing Rep. Uh, Netherwing Rep is actually incredibly old, so a lot of you probably know how to do it, but if you're looking for a video tutorial guide on where to look for it, uh, this is a good video for you because I'm going to be showing you that. So, uh, as you see at the start of the video, I already started looking up on that. Uh, oh, look at that! One right here. I am mounted my ass. Look at that. Ooh, netherwing egg. Beautiful. So this is usually where I will start my uh, netherwing. Uh, location route, I guess. So you start up on that tower, you look in it, there's not one there, you go here, you look in here, and then go to that little cart there. Um, the cart does spawn one every once in a while, as you have just seen, actually, so that's awesome. Um, I've seen one behind there, but not recently. Usually one will spawn somewhere behind this dragon there. Of course, there is almost always one in one of these towers, actually. While I was trying to record this video earlier, one spawned there, and then I found out that it didn't record the audio for the video. So, redoing it. Let's hope uh, some more spawn. So, not one up in here. There usually will be, though. So, keep an eye out up there. Same with over here. A lot of times they do spawn in these two towers, as well as the tower down there and the tower down there. Now, occasionally they will spawn inside these buildings on the uh, lower level. So it's always good to go in there and make sure you check if they're there. Um, in this building, if there ever is one, it will usually spawn on top of that fireplace there. And in this building, it's usually off to the side. Usually around here or over here. Now, there's also the top of the building you have to check. Um, usually, I've actually never seen one spawn there, so, I mean, if you see one, good view. And in this building, I've actually seen one spawn many times. Uh, right near this brazier, just beside it, right about here-ish, you will find another wing egg. If you're lucky, of course. And so that kind of covers the Dragomaw area. Doing a little flips because flips are cool. Oh my god! Anyways, so that covers the Dragomaw area, and now we're going to go over to the Netherwing uh, ledge. And this is where you will find. Mm, I'm gonna say maybe like 30% of your eggs. Well, okay, if you include the mines, I'll say about 80%, because the mines give you so many eggs, it's absolutely, absolutely ridiculous. Sometimes you'll actually see one down there, so just make sure you check here. Uh, usually what I'll do in the uh, morning, or whenever I start my uh, daily quest, I'll grab them all, and then once I do, I'll fly over here go down into the mine and start my uh, mine route searching for eggs but right now I'm just going to show you the, uh, the uh, route I take to look for the ones on the uh, giant crystal floaty land things sometimes you find them up, up here lately uh, I haven't really been finding them on the actual uh, I don't even know what you'd call these. They're floating land masses, so floating land mass. We'll call it. We'll call it FLM. A flum. So up on the flums, usually uh, they spawn around the crystals. Uh, but in the last little while, um, in the past five days, which is when I actually started doing all the uh, dailies, I've only seen them spawn there maybe once or twice. So. 
you're not always going to see them up here, but it is good to check just in case because if you miss one, you know, one egg is basically the equivalent to a uh, daily quest. So, it's always good to check. Up here, I've actually never seen eggs up here, but, you know, just in case. So I'm just continuing the route here, uh, and what you'll see soon is actually this little group of crystals down here. There is one that spawns right on top, right here-ish. So if you are ever, you know, doing this route, make sure you check the sides as well. So next I'd come back up here, check the top. If there isn't one, head back this way, check the top of this mountain. I have seen some spawn here before, so it is definitely confirmed. Now, apparently, there is a uh, netherwing egg that spawns here. I've actually never seen it, but, you know, like I said, better to check than to not get an egg or something. Cool. So then, back to the uh, little route. You continue up this little hill, and this guy has a 0.01 drop chance. I'd still kill him every once in a while, just, just in case. You never know. I doubt he will ever drop one, but or she will ever drop one. I guess you can't really be a mother if you're a guy, unless you're that crazy transsexual guy who like was a chick, then got pregnant, then became a guy, and then had a baby. Or something. I don't know. I don't even know what that has to do with another wing eggs, but that's interesting. Alright, so that's basically the route. So if you look on the map right now, this is the area we just covered. So we started here, went up here, onto the little ledges, went around here, all the way through here, checked this one, checked that, went down here, went up here, and then went down this red line. And so that's basically the route you're going to take if you're going to be looking for the nether ring. So it's kind of like... It's kind of like... I don't even know what that's kind of like. It's like you're trying to draw a cat that has no legs. So like, here's the face of the cat. Here's the no legs of the cat. And here's like... I don't even know. It's crazy. So next, I'm going to show you guys uh, the route I take in the mines. So, stay tuned for part two. The mines of Netherwing. Dun 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 dun. Awesomeness. Brr.